Hello everyone. Uh, in this quick video, it's a security advisory that I want all of my uh, viewers, subscribers to be aware of. And that is about the Cisco Jabber for Windows messaging handling arbitrary code execution vulnerability. If you notice that this one just got released today and uh, Cisco is rating this as critical and we have a CVSS base score of 9.9 so that has to be very 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 serious right the the maximum you can have is 10 so consider this as a very critical update for yourself the cv id is listed right here it's cv 20203495 and what it is uh, it this vulnerability is due to improper validation of message content and if you are an attacker, you could exploit this by sending specially crafted XMPP message, which is extensible messaging and presents protocol to the affected software. Okay, so once you are successful in exploiting this, this vulnerability, you could allow the attacker to cause the application to execute arbitrary programs on the targeted system with the privilege of the user account that is running on the Cisco Jabber client software, possibly resulting in arbitrary code execution. Now, how do you fix it? Very simple, Cisco already got a patch, okay? So there is right there, Cisco has released the software update. There is no workaround, so you cannot band it. You cannot take any other approach to fix this. Just get the patch as soon as possible and if you are if you are using this product in your environment i would highly highly recommend that you you get it and get it fixed uh, you can also take a look at which are the products that are actually got affected by this particular vulnerability and also products confirmed not uh, vulnerable uh, is here like cisco jabber for mac os or cisco jabber for mobile platforms if you have those they're not affected all right so you can you should look at the vulnerable products and make sure that you are you are okay uh, the other thing you can also do uh, quickly if you want to know more about this one uh, which i always like to do is go and do a search on this particular vulnerability as more and more information will come up you probably you can go to uh, mitre and any other website look this is uh, uh, you go and, and just uh, get some more information on this particular vulnerability as well. All right, so uh, download the download the PDF if you like about the vulnerability to learn more about it. Uh, but if you have it, again, I would highly, highly recommend that you go ahead and apply the patch and the patch is available. So why waste more time? Just test it, get it fixed and be safe. Thank you. That's all I wanted to cover in this video. Good day.